This is me, uh, Big Girl for Life. I'm sitting here with Bahamadia. She just rocked it here in St. Louis for us at STLHipHop.com and BGirl.com. Uh, she was just talking to us about, uh, I had to give her some bad news. Well, actually, it's good news for me because it's this compilation for my festival. But it's bad news for her, the way she had to find out. And I guess this just goes to speak on internet technology and just the music and how it affects artists and the MP3s and that kind of thing. So... How do you feel about this? I mean, really, is it just like total shock? I feel twisted about it. I mean, I feel like people, you know, infringing on, you know, different people's rights, you know what I mean? And it's like, like I said, I don't have a problem with technology it's if it's going to be utilized for a purpose that I believe in or a cause that I believe in. Or, you know, to help advance my position as an independent artist, but damn. You can at least get a consent form and write, you know, I, I still can't believe you don't have a copy of this. I swear I, I do not have a copy of this. And you didn't have a copy of the other one either? Nope. So, what, they expect you to go out and buy these stores like everybody? That's, that's, no, that's it, wild. It, it, I can't it, believe that. That's just, insane. That they just, just, should be done. It's just that when you have, a, like, a, um, a, like, a strong camaraderie with other artists, you know what I mean? Sometimes they look at you as a commodity and you're looking at them as your musical peers. Mm -hmm. And I, you know, I continuously get caught. I learn a lesson sooner or later. Like heads, you know what I mean? They, after shows and stuff, sometimes they want to cipher or they want to go in the studio and do a joint. And you do the joint, next thing you know, the shit is on the album. And you're not getting compensated for it. You know said anything? No, about and it depreciates your value terribly as an artist, as a, um, an established artist. Especially if it's not going to be a balance there, you know what I mean? I mean, I know you want the artist that you do a lot of songs, collaborations with other people, mm -hmm. like Brand New Heavies, uh, who else? Mashiva. Oh, Mochiba. Mochiba, yeah. Uh, sorry, who else? Um, Talib. Talib. The chaos you did. Yeah. I like that. Talib. A lot of people slept on that. Yeah. I really like that. That's that like was one, a, one of my favorite joints. Okay. That was a demo. We ne That was a demo really? version. We never went in the studio. I love high tech and, and quality. <laughs> you know, y'all know I'm not lying to my brothers. I love them. But that was a demo. We never, really? we never finished it. I no. like that song. We just went in here. I'm telling you. We went in. Me and Tali, we've been knowing each other for a while, you know what I mean? We decided we wanted to do a song and stuff like that. And I never heard about the song again. Next thing you know, Sound Bomber came. They serviced me. They did. Thank you, Raucous, because Raucous did. <laughs> they did send me a copy of it. But that's how I found out. I was like, damn. I did not know that. Yeah. Man, this so is this. You royalties and everything, though, right? Yeah. Man, yeah. they sent me the song on vinyl. It ain't nobody. even in me to be yeah. the, the law. I gotta check for that. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, I, ain't gonna lie. I gotta check for chaos. Okay. What's up, Jared and everybody over at Walkers, Talib, and I said. Oh, you start off as a DJ. A lot of people yeah. don't know that. Yep, I started off Zika Zika. Zika Zika. Yeah, and then from there I started writing like routines and um like little bars and songs and stuff for like the MCs that were part of our crew. My first crew was West Philly Sound Crew. Mm -hmm. And um, one day we had a battle and one of the MCs couldn't make it. So I filled in their slot. And then, um, in her, excuse me, her slot. And then after that, the response was just really good. I like, you know, the response. So I just continued to write and, you know, on the MC to and just evolved into an MC out of that. So you DJ anymore? No, I mean, for pleasure. I got decks at my crib and stuff like that, but I don't do clubs or anything like that. Just, just strictly for my own personal reasons, and like London and stuff like that. Thanks a lot. But no Have fish, crabs, and none of that kind of stuff. Push it out, head out. Okay. They're kicking us out. Alright, they're kicking us out. Mr. Padgett, we still right, in St. Louis. <laughs> 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 yeah, this is how to go. We are. Uh, thanks, this is Bahamadi.